All right, what we got is an all clad, all clad slow cooker. Uh, it's one of their expensive units and uh, it just doesn't power on. So we can plug it in. We got no response from any buttons, no lights, no display, nothing. Kind of a glare on that thing from the camera. So let's get this open. I'm gonna cover that just as a reminder, safety reminder. I won't plug this in now. So the trick with these is you wanna get this clear display off, this clear cover. Let's get a couple pry tools, get it under it. Use something plastic that won't damage it. Because once you get it under, there's latches on either side of this thing that hold it into the cast. And now we can pry up in the middle and start loosening it up and popping it off like that. There you go. See? Now what we've got is you want to use something sharp, exacto chisel blade or this screwdriver I have uh, ground down to a fine edge. Use it for a lot. You want to get this sticker pulled back because what you're going to find are uh, a couple Phillips head screws behind it. Always look behind stickers. They like to hide stuff behind there. And now why isn't that screw coming out? Of course, it's stainless, not magnetic. Yeah. Uh, how am I getting you out? Uh, see, it just doesn't grab very well. Non-magnetic. We're some silly putty. And let gravity do it. There you go. And the other side's got the same thing. Just gently hit that edge there. Because there's no uh, no surface where the screw goes in. It doesn't hold very well right there. So now we get to try and get this one out again. Right? Gravity. Yeah, of course, you gotta let it go and it closes up. Um, now, hold on. why? Why do you leave it in there? Where's it gonna go? All right, we've got two larger torques up here. Don't recall the size. Um, we'll take those out. You see those other four? You don't really need those yet. Come on, what's going on here? There we go. So that that gets that whole piece free and you just see it's just a heavy cast piece on it it's got some plastic push buttons in it this is a good it's a good time to clean those surfaces when they're exposed so this will be the display board it's going to be in a plastic box metal shield we'll probably put these screws in before we finalize on the bottom Let's get these nuts off. And now the whole bottom is just gonna lift off of here. It's just a couple screw posts that are holding it together. And that's all you need to do to get this bottom loose is have that front off and get these off. You can see there's this whole uh, springy compression thing. Here's our wires that are still attached. So we can go to the smaller torque size and take these four out. And this is, uh, we'll, we'll do this when we put it together. We'll, we'll sandwich the whole thing up in there because now it gives you more freedom. Now you're just stuck with this. So it's got some holder clips on there. Not really clips. Um, it's little molded pieces that kind of pinch those wires in there. Let's get this board out. Got four screws at the bottom you can take out. And that'll get this uh, power supply board out of the way. Come on. Keeps catching on the edge. 
and pick it up. Those are magnetic. So now we can pull this whole power supply board out of this plastic shielded housing. Now these spade clips, they've got a, a clip on them, spade lugs. There's a clip on them that retain them in. It's a good safety feature. If you squeeze them up towards the top, take a close look, you'll, you'll see that little clip. You push on it and it'll release. Yeah, it's up north towards the, closer to where the crimp is. So now we just get our thermocouple off. Again, that goes into that center springy thing that touches the bottom of the, the dish. And we can put this all together. All right, or, uh, yeah, you see how that thermocouple is? And then there's our red and blue line. Blue line goes straight through. Red goes into the center. It's probably some kind of some kind of safety switch in there that cuts out and then it comes out the black wire and onto the power supply board. We'll put this together and we'll get back to the other side.